still think in the sunset You know I never wanna make you upset How did I become so upset? I need a few more ingredients before we can start cooking Child, I have no style. Why do these computer parts smell like gunpowder and barbecue sauce? Yo, Daywalker, hi. We dropped the shit out of our bags running for our life when the city went all cray. Those bags are like full of totally vital stuff. You think you can get them for us? They're GPS chipped. Getting them should be a cinch for you. like you got all the ingredients we need. Don't lose them on the way back. Did you see those traps outside the base? I ran out of time setting them up. Can you finish the job for me? 
Set up a few more hack and slay traps around that barricade. Get out to the front of the base. I've been messing around with some trap designs. Just uploaded the plans for a new trap to your phone. Traps will chop up any OD that get near it. Those pack and play traps won't hurt you, don't worry. I just uploaded the bling board trap to your phone. This trap will send enemies back to where they came from. Be sure to point it away from the base. Switch to the bling board trap, then place it. You gotta keep an eye on your power usage. Each time you place a trap, it will use up some power. When we're out, we're out. You can always remove traps to get power back. Keep an eye on your traps. The OD can destroy them. If a trap is destroyed, you'll get power back. Power grid is at max capacity. Place as many traps as you can. These traps should be good for tonight, but we'll need better ones soon. I'm no engineer, or am I? Well, there might be other survivors out there who know how to build better traps. So look around when you're out in the city. When you're done placing traps, turn that valve and we'll get down to business. All right, way to use up all that energy. If you want some energy back, you can just pick up any trap you already placed.
bad, not bad. You could have been better, but you'll get the hang of it. Thanks, Floyd. Good job. Be sure to equip those amps and let me know. This old guy, Inspector, I think his name's Walter, he came in, said he knows you, so I gave him your propeller. What? He looked kind of pissed. Yeah, that's Walter. Hey, kid. Nice try with the propeller, but you fucked it up. Maybe the overpass. God damn it. Working my ass off to repair this thing, then you go behind my back and make a new propeller. You looking to steal my glider? No, it wasn't like that. I... I'm fucking with you, kid. Can't you see me smiling? Ha ha. It's a fine propeller. We're almost ready to fly out of here. The only problem is, a few minutes ago, some scabs stumbled across the glider. I held them off, but they stole my glide wheel. Glide wheel? Sounds made up. Well, how about you make yourself up a way to get it back? And hurry, those scabs will be back soon. I'll wait here. I saw the scabs heading towards the amphitheater, down by the waterfront. Glide wheel, I think. I better get back to Walter before he has a stroke. Something else old people get and then die. Oh, just making me angry. Walter, you okay? He told you they'd come back. Get over here and help me fend them off.
come on back to the glider. Over here. Thanks. Anything else? I fitted this thing with some weapons. Give them a try. Sam, is the virus ready? Yes. I mean, no. I mean, I don't know. I mean, I think so. Uh, I've only ever written viruses for government websites, never anything like this.
Sam, we're running out of time here. I'm compiling now, but the linker is really slow. Sam, is the virus ready? Yes. I mean, no. I mean, I don't know. I mean, I think so. Uh, I should have a favorite viruses from government websites. Never anything like this. We'll miss you, you cranky motherfucker. I'm sorry, Floyd. Just wish I could have saved him. Best thing you can do is keep being yourself. Keep that swagger going. Cool? Yeah. Hey, Walter talked about this guy. Named Brill Cream. Says he was the smartest guy around. 
You find that guy, I bet he'll figure out how to escape the city. Real cream? What kind of a name is that? One that's easy to remember, I guess. Anyway, Walter said there was ham radio signals coming from a Japanese museum nearby. Might be him. You should check it out. I bet you're wondering how Walter and I ended up together. I just assumed you were twin brothers. So many similarities. We met at a party. Huh? Or was it the DM? I can't remember. Anyway, one thing I do remember is Walter didn't judge me for how I looked, how I talked, how I dressed. He told me, don't judge people. Judge their actions. He was he kind of a zen motherfucker that way, and I loved him for it. He and I talked about you a lot. Oh, my character moment sense is tingling. Is there something special about you? But it's buried beneath a whole lot of wise ass. Oh, gee whiz, thanks for the revelation, Freud. Damn it, I just proved your point, didn't I? Like I said, man, I don't judge people, just their actions. My point is, don't let you get in the way of yourself. Did you just cook up a philosopher amp or something? <laughs> 